going to the top. Ow! It's hard to beat this. Hula. Like Adam in the Garden of Eve. My bitch got an apple bottom and she swallowed my seed. Swallow my leaf, fire I breathe, water my seed. Good morning. So the same hike that I did with my family a couple days ago. It's our last day, so I'm gonna do it alone. And I figure why not record it. It's uh, actually, you gotta walk along the beach and then I'm going to the top of that mountain. It's called Fort Barrington. Good morning. I actually got shoes on right now. Zero HFS, barefoot style running shoes. shouldn't take long. I'm thinking like 30 minutes. Cause I already got the pictures I wanted. So now, I'm just gonna get up there as quickly and safely as possible. Right now it's 8.18 in the morning. I figured I'll be back at like 8.45, 8.48. Let's see. If you're hiking through like a forest, I probably wouldn't recommend wearing no shirt, but being that I'm on the beach and a lot of this trail is out in the open, I won't be getting scratched by branches and stuff. And I gotta be really careful in these shoes because I'm still learning how to walk and run in them. I've been doing it pretty much exclusively for a couple months now, but oh, this view is insane. Crazy. All right. So this is the top of the trail or the bottom of the trail. I'm going to the top. Let's get it. I really got to pay attention to where I'm running because these shoes don't have much protection at all. So if I step on a rock, I feel the sensation. I'm not making excuses, but I just left the gym. So I'm kind of winded. There's the rope. this time so it's gonna be might be a little longer than 30 minutes oh it's a good shot Look at that view. All 
I was gonna wear my my barefoot water shoes, but I didn't want rocks and dirt to get in them while I'm running up this hill. Oh yeah. Ooh. Steep fall. I mean, just look how blue the water is. You can see the bottom. I just be grateful when I'm out here. This, this helps you connect to God. It's so powerful. Mother Nature is undefeated. See, this is farther than we went last time. So when it's just me, a little bit faster. Depending on where it is, because sometimes I might want to stop for longer. I just like to sit and appreciate things. That's cool. It's 8:25. It's been about eight minutes or seven minutes. I'm already on the other side of the hill or mountain, whatever you want to call it. I almost didn't bring my tripod. So I was like, oh, I want to have my hands free. Then I'm like, you know, when's the next time I'm going to be in Antigua? Might as well document most of it. Wow. That tree. It's like peppers or something. Looks like some type of pepper. I will not be trying them though. I got some fresh soursop yesterday. Fresh mangoes, golden apples, guineps, banana. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. That is intense. Oh yeah, this goes all the way down. I'm supposed to be down here. Hopefully there's nothing poisonous. Oh, ho, ho. Wow. Yeah, that's it. Might have to get in. For real, for real. Yo. Oh my gosh. It's hard to beat this. 
my shoes are ruined. Not ruined, they're just really dirty. Hit them with some Jason Mark, would be good. I don't want to get stung by a sea urchin. Actually, I really want to get in. Screw it. Oh, wow, well, I'm getting in now. <laughs> All right. This hurts. Nothing compared to our family trips My uncle shook hands with the manly grip All this hand-me-down shit I had Had an uncanny fit All the gangsters I had in my family had me any bitch My granddaddy mistress caught the business from my granny fist That was back before I was born Pop told stories about it that would last for hours long And as a family we was just so happy when him and mama got along On the Bobble uh, On our way to that black amusement park Wood roller coasters crack sold on plastic scooter cars Smoking grass at the vintage food court. Broken glass waiting on you on the swimming pool floor. These rocks are sharp as hell. Oh. Or my feet are just really sensitive. Back to the beach. So I gotta go back up, back down. Should be pretty easy. I just, oh, my watch. Almost forgot my watch. I wanna get a quick swim in before I leave. Maybe eat some fruit. So there it is. Ow! Wow! Spikes. Thornberry is an actual type of berry. Just thought about that. <laughs> Look at all these thorns. Oh, wrong way. Look at that. Sheesh. Something scraped my leg. This was a good workout for travel day. Cause I gotta go three hours, three or four hours. I think like three hour flight to Miami from Antigua and then a three hour layover in Miami, which I'm not looking forward to, but the good thing about it is I'll have time to edit some videos and be productive. So, you know, it's not all bad, but still nobody wants to sit in an airport. At least I don't. Oh, look at that trail. All right, I'm gonna run straight up. 
Let's get it. are sick. Beautiful. Pretty much done and it took about 50 minutes. And that's because I stopped. If not, it would have taken me like 25 minutes. It's a relatively easy hike. Still a little challenging because of the steepness and the, the risk because there are some pretty steep edges but you know it's really not that bad and it's really scenic so all in all if you come to Antigua check out Fort Barrington yeah check out Fort Barrington tell them Troy sent you this little green screen effect is cool I think I'm gonna use this more. Back on the beach. Boy. All right, I think it's proper for the shoes to come off now. I think that's proper. Ooh, what it feels nice. All right, y'all, tapping out. Thank you guys for tuning in my Antiguan adventures it's been cool to tap in with my roots meet some family members friends of family see my grandma's property and, and until the next time we out